Hello everyone, this is Al Red Sox Fan coming to you from Al Red Sox Fan YouTube channel. Hope all is well. We're going to continue with our Action PC 1970 College Elite 8 playoff. This is the fourth game in the Elite 8. The last ticket to be punched to the Final Four. And it will be OSU, otherwise known as Ohio State Buckeyes versus the Tennessee Volunteers. So it's OSU versus the Vols. I'll be playing as Ohio State. The Action PC Sim Engine, Tennessee Volunteers. In 1970, Ohio State would go 9-1, and one, lose in the Rose Bowl, and drop to number 5 in the final AP poll. They lost to Stanford in the Heisman Trophy winner, Jim Plunkett, 27-17. to The Tennessee Vols would jump to number four in the final AP poll. They were 11-1, and they defeated Air Force in the Sugar Bowl, 34-13. to The other three games are up on the channel. I've put the links in the chat that hopefully will replay. I've adjusted everything all over again. I don't know why YouTube changes things, but... Well, hopefully the live chat will replay. If not, it's also on the page, the first three games. Um, Stanford, Nebraska, game one. Game two, Arizona State versus Texas. And then game three, last night, LSU versus Notre Dame. All right, so it's going to be the Ohio State Buckeyes. Again, I'm playing as the Buckeyes. The Action PC Sim Engine, the Tennessee Volunteers. For Ohio State, the running backs are Hayden and Brockington. John Brockington would go on to play for the Packers. The wideouts, who they very rarely throw to, Zelina and Janikowski. The tight end is White. Kern is the quarterback. The tackles are Cheney and Simmon. The guards are Donovan and Teague. And the center is DeLeon. For the Tennessee Volunteers, the running backs are Watson and McLeary. Thompson and McLean are your wideouts. Thierley, or Thelier is the tight end. Bobby Scott is the quarterback. I think he went on to quarterback the Bears and the Saints in the NFL. Um, Robinson and Ball, Balthrop are your tackles. Kell and Denbo are the guards. Bevins is the center. On defense, Ohio State... The defensive ends, Dibivik, good luck with that name, Lutner, the defensive tackles, I think they cut off that name, uh, so Williams is one defensive tackle, it looks like Hassel something, White, Stan White went on to play for the Colts, uh, White's an outside linebacker. Still wagons a middle linebacker. Adams, the other outside linebacker. Cornerbacks are Sensabong and Howard. The safeties are Anderson and my all-time least favorite NFL player, Jack Tatum. For Tennessee, the ends are Mixon and Drummond. The defensive tackles are Emmendorf. Again, the last name got cut off. We'll give it to you when we get there. And Wagster. Linebackers, Walker, Rotella, and Nettles. Cornerbacks, Graham and Allen. Safeties, Majors and Priest. Ohio State won the toss, and Woody Hayes wants the ball. Let's bring the field up. So here we are in Tennessee. Fifty-four degrees, clear skies, wind zero to five miles per hour. Tennessee to kick off. Back deep for Ohio State, John Brockington. Shortman are Harris and Janikowski. Uh, the return is on. The kickoff by the Vols. Feel it around the 10 to the 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. Goes John Brockington. A 35-yard run for the big back from OSU. Probably should have just done the preview from here where I can read all the names. Might still mispronounce them, but I can at least see them. 
Rex Kern, who's not going to throw the ball a ton. He's a more of a running quarterback. Under center, John Hayden's one back. John Brocken in the other. Wide out, seldom used. Larry Zelina. They better block good. And Bruce Janikowski. The tight end, Jan White. Cheney, Donovan, DeLeon, Teague, Simmon are your line. For the Tennessee Vols, Mixon, Wagster, Emmendorfer, Drummonds are the defensive line. Your cornerbacks are Allen and Graham. Linebackers, Walker, Rotella, and Nettles. Safeties, Tim Priest and Bobby Majors. So here we go, first and ten. Great field position for OSU on their 45. Hayden will go out wide, get that extra blocker there. Brockington on the run counter, off tackle left, John Brockington. There goes John Brockington, and he puts his head down, struggles for two yards, Brock, brought down by Bill Emmendorfer. So it's going to be second and eight on the OSU 47. Kearns will call his own number on the dive. Kearns takes a delay and up the middle, and he is stuffed by Majors. Oh, my Lord, they're looking for that play. So Kearns, no gain. Bobby Majors makes the tackle. Third and eight. Third and eight. Brockington to go out wide. Third and eight. Off tackle left, John Hayden. Hayden's got a little bit of running room. Rotella will bring him down. Gain of four. And it's going to be fourth and four on the Tennessee 49. Here comes the punt team. Gary Lago to punt to Johnny Majors. Lago with the boot. Majors fields it around the 10. Brings it out to the 15. Flag on the play. Illegal block. Receiving team. And that's going to push the Vols back. The illegal block on Rotella. And the Tennessee Vols will start first and 10 on their six. At quarterback, Bobby Scott. Again, I think he played with the Bears and the Saints. Kurt Watson at one back. Don McCleary the other. Wideouts Lester McCain. Joe Thompson. Tight end, Gary Fellier. The line, Robinson. Kell, the center's Bevins. Denbo. And Ballthrop. Split backfield. That's what the AI is going with. Four down linemen for the Ohio State Buckeyes. We're going to play our line out wide. We're going to shoot our middle linebacker. Tatum's going to come up and run support. And we're going to play man run coverage. It's a run to the left, and that's going to get smothered under. Only a two yard gain for Watson, tackled by Debivik. And it's going to be second and eight for the Vols on their eight. So second and eight. Our line's going to go out wide again. This time we're going to blitz Stan White. Second and eight. Man pass coverage. Flag on the play. Probably. False start. Offense. Repeat. Second down. Bobby Scott with the head bob. False start. That's going to back him up. To be second and 12 now on the Tennessee four. Second and 12. Defensive line out wide. They're going to show blitz, but they're not going to blitz. Tatum will play back, and we're going to play man-run coverage. Scott's going to throw from his end zone. He's going to heave it deep and complete on a tight end. 30 yards to Thelier on the long slant tackled by Anderson. So the Vols get out from the shadow of their own end zone. It's going to be first and 10 on the 34. Bobby Scott happy with himself. 
Defensive line out wide. Still wagon will blitz the middle. Tatum up for run support. Man run coverage. It's a handoff up the middle, and it's going to be a decent run springing through the blitz is Watts, and he's brought down by Anderson for the Buckeyes. Watson now has two carries, eight yards. Tim Anderson with his second tackle, second and four for Tennessee on their 40. Defensive line in tight. We'll play, we're going to skew the rest of our defense to the out. Tatum up and run support. Show blitz, but we're not going to blitz. Man run coverage. It's a run up the middle, and that is stuffed. It will be a favorable spot. Wow. They give Watson a yard. Dabivik with the tackle. That's Dabivik's second tackle. So it's going to be a third and three for Tennessee on their 41. Woody Hayes looking for the stop here. Third and three. Defensive line out wide. White and still wagon will blitz. Man run coverage. Scott back to pass. Here comes a blitz. Scott looking, looking, throws, and it's picked off. It is picked off by OSU. Interception by Senzenbaugh and Bobby Scott. Cannot duplicate his 30-yard pass to get him away from the goal line. Earlier in the drive, he throws a pick to Sensenbaugh, and that is a huge play. Ohio State, as the pressure got to Bobby Scott, and he just heaved it where he shouldn't have heaved it. Here's the replay. Again, the colors change on the replay. Bobby Scott throws it, and there's the pick. Nearly a pick six. As the ball is on the Tennessee 35, Ohio State with a state with a golden opportunity here. Ohio State will go with an I formation now. The up back is Brockington. Behind him is John Hayden. Hayden's going to get the call up the middle. Hayden. And not much there. No three yards and a cloud of dust. No gain. Good job by the Vols defense. Tackled by Bill Emmendorfer. That's his second. They were keying on Hayden. So it's going to be second and ten out of the eye. Brockington on the screen on second and ten. Kern's going to throw his first pass here. And incomplete. In and out of the hands of John Brockington. The heavy pass rush. Hurried Kern. Third and ten. Third and ten. For the Buckeyes, split backs. Read option left. Kern to keep. Read option left. Kern keeps the ball. And he's close to the first down. And he's got it. Gain of 10. For Rex Kern. That is a huge play. Here's the replay. On the read option left. Kern keeps it. First and 10 on the Tennessee 25. Split backs again. Hayden to go out wide. Brockington to get the call. Off tackle right for Big John Brockington. Brockington puts his head down and plows for two. Wagster on the tackle. Rotella was in there. And Rotella looks like he's hurt. He's going off the field. It's his foot. He'll be back in a few plays. Word from the sideline. So second and eight from the Tennessee 23. Hayden out wide. Special. Read option right. Kern to keep. Here comes the read option right. Kern's got some room and he's got the first down. Rex Kern picks up nine. Bringing him down for the Vols was Graham. Conrad Graham makes his first tackle. Rex Kern chewing up some yards here. Three carries, 19 yards. First and 10 for the Buckeyes on the Vols, 14. The 
Brockington goes out wide. Hayden will get the call up the middle. Dive play to Hayden. Hayden lumbers forward for three. Rotella just coming in on back on the field makes the tackle. Jamie Rotella with a second tackle for Tennessee. It's going to be second and seven. Just over nine minutes of play in the first quarter. Brock and then go out wide. Hayden, run counter, run counter, off tackle left. They go the other way with Hayden. Hayden's got a little seam, and he gets three. Tackled by Mixon. A big third and four coming up for OSU. Ball on the Tennessee eight, under nine minutes to play in the first quarter. Third and four. Hayden will go out wide. Read option. Read option left. The give will be to Brockington. Stick with the play call. Read option left. Brockington gets the ball. First down. Touchdown, Johnny Brockington. OSU scores. O-S-U. O-S-U. And it is 6-0 Buckeyes on the read option right. Left, excuse me. This time they give the ball to John Brockington. Here's the replay. As Kern gives the ball up. Brockington goes in for six. Six nothing, Ohio State. Here's the extra point. The snap, the place, the kick. And it is good. So Scram makes the point. Seven nothing, Ohio State. 7.55 to play in the first quarter. Scram to put the ball down on the tee. McLean's deep for the volunteers. Mellum and McCleary, the short man. Here's the kick, kick by Scram. Fielded around the 5. 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. He could go all the way. He could go all the way. He could go all the way. Touchdown. What an answer by the Tennessee Vols. As Millum took the ball from his sixth and then was off to pay dirt. Great blocking by the kick return team and it is seven to six just like that the volunteers strike they're an extra point away and woody hayes is none too happy on the ohio state sideline the fans at neyland stadium are loving it in tennessee here's the replay the kickoff Millam finds a seam. Look at that blocking. Look at that blocking. And then he just outruns the rest of the Ohio State coverage team into the end zone. 7-6. to six. So Tennessee answers quite quickly. Extra point to tie it here. The snap, the place, the kick. And it is good. Sneaks through the left side. 7-7. Seven, seven. And Woody Hayes is irate on the sideline. You can see the veins coming out of his neck. He's looking for a Clemson kid to smack. So here come Ohio State now. John Brockton back deep. Harris and Janikowski, the short men. The kickoff by Tennessee. Short. That's going to be 25-30 as Harris with a 13-yard return. Brought down by Lindsey. So it's a 7-7 ball game. With 7.27 to play in the first quarter. Again, split backs. Hayden and Brockington. Zelena and Janikowski. Your wideouts. White's the tight end. Kern's under center. Kern is under center. Brockington will go out wide. Extra blocker. To the right, next to the tight end. Hayden behind Kern. 
read option left. They're going to give it to Hayden. And Hayden picks up three as Brockington got the call. Did I, obviously, I clicked on the wrong, but they picked up three. So second and seven. Second and seven. Hayden goes out wide. Brockton to get the call. Off tackle right. There goes John Brockton. And there's no seam there. He struggles for a yard. Brought down by Waxter and company. For the Volunteers, John Waxter with a second tackle. Brockington will now come off the field. And Rick Gal Galbos will come in. Hayden will come off the field. And James Colbert, not the actor, will come in. So Rick Galbos, good for about four carries, six yards, over six yards a carry, 6.3. And James Colburn looks like he was a blocking back. Colburn will go out wide. Galbos will get the call. Pitch right to Galbos. Kern doesn't like what he sees. Kern's going to call the bootleg. Here comes the bootleg. Kern turns the corner and knocked down by Majors. Keeps the gain to a minimum. It's a four-yard gain. Kern thought he was going to turn the corner for a big gainer. It's going to be fourth and two. Fourth and two. Uh, fourth and two. For Ohio State. How is that fourth and two? It's fourth and two. Did I just go to sleep for three plays? Kickoff. Oh, no, we did run. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We ran two plays. They were so bad I forgot. So it's fourth and two. That play did not work. And we will punt the ball. Lago will punt to Majors. So that tackle by Majors was huge. Look like Kern was going to turn the corner. Field it around the 25. Gets it out to the 30. Majors with an 8-yard return. Brought down by Lutner. So Tennessee in a 7-7 game and 5-55 to play in the first quarter. Have it first and 10 on their 31. Under center is Bobby Scott, who has thrown a pick. Watson and McCleary are your running backs. Thompson and McLean, your wideouts. And Thelier, who had a 30-yard reception. is the tight end at the stadium Gary M hope all is well thank you for joining us we're going to play a defensive line out wide blitz white actually going to blitz uh, still wagon in the middle Tatum comes up and runs support and man run coverage it's a pitch out, it's a pitch out, and it's going to get annihilated. Loss of four as Stillwagon comes flying through the middle. And the rest of Ohio State defense string it out wide, and Stillwagon makes the tackle. Tackle number one for Jim Stillwagon. be second and 14. Let's see if they're going to let Bobby Scott throw the ball here. Second and 14. Still wagging to spy the quarterback. Show blitz, but don't blitz. Man pass coverage. Bobby Scott back to pass. He throws the out, and it's complete. Close to the first down. Gain of 13 as Howard knocks McLean out of bounds, and it's a manageable, very makeable third and one. A nice toss by Bobby Scott. Third and one now for the Vols. On their 40. If you're just joining us, Ohio State scored a touchdown. And then on the kickoff, Tennessee ran it back. That's how we stand, 7-7. Defensive line in tight. Still wagon and White will blitz. Tatum up and run support. Man run coverage. It's a handoff, and I think we got it behind the line of scrimmage. They're going to measure. They are short by a few inches. OSU holds, baby. What a play. Shade Williams with the tackle. But there was a lot of penetration there. 
by the Buckeyes defense, and that makes Woody Hayes crack just a bit of a smile. So the Vols sent out their punt team. We're going to watch for the fake, even though... The, here's the punt! Fielded around the 20, 25, 30, 35, 36. Goes Anderson. It's a 17-yard return brought down by Majors. 7-7 seven, seven ball game. The Buckeyes have it first and 10 on their 35. Kern under center. White's at Ted, tight end. Janikowski and Zelina are the wideouts. Galbos and Calburn are your backs as we give Hayden and Brockington a rest. Galbos. Uh, Colburn goes out wide. Read option right. Turn to keep. Rex Kern to keep the ball. He's got some decent room there. Picks up four. Four tech, tough yards for Kern, who's now carried the ball five times for 27 yards. It'll be second and six. Second and six. Second and six. Strong left night now as the tight end. White goes to the top of the screen. Rick Galbos, run counter. Off tackle left. Galbos gets the carry. And he's going to pick up four tough yards, whipped down by Rotella. As they run behind Cheney. So it's a third and two. Third and two. I want to put Hayden is going to come back in, but I want him to be the up back. And John Brockenden will come back in as they're both at 100% stamina now. We're going to I formation. The up back is Hayden. Brockenden behind him. Third and two. Brockenden to get the call. They're going to try to ram this ball right in the middle. They're going to stick with the play call. And Brockenden has the first. He keeps his legs churning. They pick up the two necessary yards. David Allen with the tackle with some help from his friends, but it's first and 10 for the Buckeyes on their 45. Two tight ends set now. The tight ends are White and Janikowski actually just comes in. We don't have another tight end except for one of our receivers, but he must be a decent blocker. Nope, we don't. So we're going two tight end set. The wide out is Larry Zelina. Hayden will go out. Um, Hayden will go out wide. Read option. Read option right. We're going to give it to John Brock and flag on the play. False start. Offense, five-yard penalty. Repeat, first down. DeLeon with the false start, and that's going to back up the Buckeyes five yards. It's going to be first and 15, what Woody Hayes does not want. We'll stick with our two tight end set. This time, Brockington will go out wide. Hayden, run counter, run counter, trapped left on first and 15. Hayden gets the call. Hayden is stuffed as the line holds up. Hayden Rotella brings him down. Jamie Rotella with his fourth tackle. Volunteers are playing a 4-3 basic run loose man, so they're just exploding to the ball right now. Second and 15. And now Woody Hayes goes to something they probably won't go to ever, if you know Woody Hayes. We're going to go with three wideouts, and we just want to spread the Vols' defense out a bit. Brockington's alone back, and we're going to put him out wide. Kern... Let's bring the tight end strong right. Well, if you're looking at Tennessee's point, that's a strong left. I'm looking at it from the other side. so I think that is the right on my side. So let's do that. Sweep right. Kern 
Kern keeps the ball. Kern cannot turn the corner as Wagster knocks him off his feet. Not an inch. And it is third and 15. As that play didn't work. Third and 15. 238 left in the first quarter. 7-7. Seven, seven. Brockington in the flat. This isn't going to be good. It's picked off. Kern throws the pick. Rotella makes the pick at the 45. Picks up two yards as he stumbles forward. And Tennessee will have a golden opportunity here. First and 10 on the Buckeye 43. Here's the replay. Trying to hit Brockington in the flat. Actually, Brockington went over the middle when we wanted him to go to the flat. And that's a pick. So Tennessee has it. Great field position. 7-7 seven, seven game. 229 in the first quarter. Left in the first quarter. Watson and McCleary, your wide out, uh, your running backs. Thompson, McLean, your wideouts. Thelier, the tight end. Bobby Scott, who's thrown a pick, is under center. Defensive line will play in tight. Our four down linemen. The rest of our defense will skew to the out. Show blitz, but don't blitz. Tatum comes up and runs support. Man run coverage. Bobby Scott, it's a give to the left, and there's nothing there. As Watson is hammered by Stillwagon, no gain. Second and ten. This has been a defensive struggle so far. For the Volunteers on the OSU 43. Defensive line now goes to the out. White will blitz from the outside. Second and ten. Man pass coverage. Bobby Scott's going to throw the ball. He over the middle. Almost picked off as Anderson jumps the route. And he claps his hands. Anderson thought he was going to have a pick after the Tatum deflection. So third and ten now. For the Volunteers on the 43 of Ohio State. 149 left in the first quarter. 7-7 ball game. Defensive line out wide. Show blitz, but we're not going to blitz. Still wagon will spy the quarterback. Man pass coverage. Bobby Scott back to pass. Looking, 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 looking. He throws incomplete. As Scott was looking for McLean, good coverage, a good pass rush by OSU. After showing the blitz, the down four lineman got the rush there. Here comes the punt team for Tennessee. The return is on. They're going to try to pin OSU back deep. And it's going to go out around the 11, I think. The officials start walking up the field a bit. They're going to say it rolls out at the 14 on the 29-yard punt. So the Buckeyes have it first and 10. On their 14, Brockton, Brockington and Hayden are your backs. Zelina and Janikowski are your wideouts. White is the tight end. Kern is under center. He has completed two passes to the other team. He's thrown two picks. Actually, he's 0 for 2 with one pick. Only one pick, but he's 0 for 2. I formation. The up back is Hayden. Brockton behind him. Brockington. On the dive play, they're going to attack that middle. Brockton has no seam whatsoever. Struggles for a yard. Tackled by Graham. As the volunteers swarm to the football. Second and nine. Under a minute to play in the first quarter. Second and nine. Quick pitch to Brockington. Kern pitches it out to Brockington. Brockington is nailed. Fumble. And Tennessee has it. Rotella drills. Brockington at the 16. The ball pops loose. Wagster falls on it. And Tennessee once again. A golden opportunity to take the lead here. With 25 seconds left in the first quarter. Scott under center. Thirdly is the tight end. McLean and Thompson, your wideouts. McCleary and Watson, the backs. 
4-3 set for the Buckeyes. Tatum up in run support. Show blitz, but we're not going to blitz. Man run coverage. Punt. Scott, handoff up the middle. A tough run for three yards by McCleary. As George Hasslerhor makes the tackle, and that ends the first quarter. We go to the second quarter, knotted at seven. Second and seven from the OSU 13. Bobby Scott surveys the situation. 4-3 set for the Buckeyes. Defensive line in tight. The rest of the defense skewing to the out. Still wagon will spy Scott. Second and seven. Man pass coverage. Bobby Scott's going to pitch it to the left. And still wagon. Big tackle there. Holds McCleary to a five-yard gain. McCleary trying to get to the out. And quickly into the end zone. A big third and two now for the Volunteers on the Buckeye 8. Third and 2. Third and 2. Defensive line in tight. Third and 2. White and Stillwagon will blitz. Tatum up and run support. Man goal line. And Ohio State calls timeout. A little confusion on the defense. Woody Hayes not happy with that. Two timeouts left for the Buckeyes in the first half. So we do it all over again. Third and two. Defensive line in tight. Tatum up and run support. Man run coverage. Scott's going to throw. Hits the tight end. Touchdown! So Scott, seeing Tatum up in run support, throws a quick hitter to Gary Thelier, and he's in for the score, and the Volunteers take a 13-7 lead. Here's the Scott to Thelier touchdown pass. The extra point now. Snap the place, the kick, and it is good. So 14-7, the Volunteers on top. Tennessee to kick off. Back deep for Ohio State, John Brockman, Harris, and Janikowski. The short men. The return is on. Here's the kick by Tennessee. Fielded around the 20, uh, 15, 20, 25, 35 goes Brockington. Tackled by Nettles. A 21-yard return for John Brockington. Hayden. Off tackle right. Out of the split backfield. Hayden. Fumbles! And who's got it? Oh, my Lord. Janikowski falls on it. Woody Hayes would have had a coronary if they lost another ball. That would have been three turnovers in a row. So Hayden coughs it up. But Janikowski comes away with the pigskin. Second and eight. Hayden goes out. Rick Galbos comes in. Second and eight. Galbos, run counter. Trap left, stick with the play call. Galbos, first down and more! Pass midfield as he bowls over one volunteer and explodes for 15 yards. Finally brought down by Jamie Rotella. That's Rotella's sixth tackle. Big first down for the Buckeyes. They have it at the Tennessee 48. Brockington and Galbos in the backfield. Brockington. Off tackle right. There goes John Brockington. Not much room there. Drummond's with the tackle. Only a gain of one. Drummond's held him up and got some help bringing John Brockington down. Second tackle for Drummond's. Second and nine. Second and nine. Brockington to go out wide. Ricky Galbos. Pitch right. Can Galbos turn the corner? Flag on the play. Flag on the play. Did Tennessee jump? Offsides. Defense. Tennessee jump. Penalty. Buckeyes accept that. It's now second and four. Second and four. Galbos goes out, and James Colburn comes in. They'll go to an I formation here. 
Colburn should be the up back, and he is. Brockington behind him. Brockington. Trap right, John Brockington. Brockington is stuffed. Minimal gain of a yard. Nettles on the tackle. Ray Nettles, second tackle for the Tennessee Volunteers. It's going to be a third and two. Buckeyes trailing by seven. Tennessee 14, Ohio State 7. 12.42 left in the first half. Brockington on the dive. Hopefully Colburn can make a big block here. And Brockington is close, and he makes it. As Brockington lowers his shoulder and plows for a three. That's Woody Hayes, Ohio State football for you. Ground and pound. First down on the Tennessee 38. I formation again. Tight end will now go strong left. Brockington, run counter. Off tackle right. They go the other way. Brockington is knocked sideways, stumbles for two yards. Simmons on the tackle. Ronnie, actually it's going to be Ronnie Drummonds as they were running behind Simmons, excuse me. Really you didn't get a lot of room there. Second and eight. Second and eight from the Tennessee 36. Brockington will come out. He's at 87% stamina. Hayden will come in. So big backfield here. Second and eight. I formation. Hayden. Trap left. There goes Hayden. He's got a little bit of running room. Mixon on the tackle for Tennessee. Picks up three, third, and five. This is two down territory for the Buckeyes. 11-12 left in the half. Volunteers 14, the Buckeyes 7. Colburn goes out wide. And the tight end will shift down. It'll be a strong right. Hayden. Off tackle right. Extra blocker to that side. Hayden picks up three. Graham torpedoes him. The safety comes up. That's Conrad Graham's third tackle. John Hayden, eight carries, 18 yards. Fourth and two, and the offense stays on the field. Fourth and two. Fourth and two. What do you do? Fourth and two. Rex Kern calls his own number. Kern up the middle. He's got it aboard. He stiff arms two Tennessee volunteers as he goes for 14. Finally brought down by Bobby Majors. That's Majors' fifth tackle. So Kern calls his own number. Rex Kern, seven carries, 41 yards, first and 10 for the Buckeyes on the Tennessee 16. They're trying for the tying score here. As once again, it's Hayden and Colburn in the backfield. They're going to go I formation. Strong right with the tight end. Hayden. Trap right. Hayden. Not much there at all. Does he get back to the line of scrimmage? Yes, he does. Spun down by Nettles. Ray Nettles with his third tackle for the Volunteers. It'll be second and ten. From the Tennessee 16. Hayden goes out. John Brockenden comes in. Colburn still the up back. We're going to go strong left with the tight end. Read option right. Read option right. The give will be to Brockington. Brockington on the read option. Doesn't get much. In fact, barely gets back to the line of scrimmage. Walker was blitzing. That blew up the read option right. As Nettles mops up the play. Makes his fourth tackle for the Volunteers. A big third and ten here. Third and ten for Ohio State. Brockton and Colburn will both go out wide. Kern on the draw. Third and ten. Kern 
On the draw! Touchdown, Rex Kerr! O S U O S U and the Buckeyes are an extra point away from tying this game at 14. So Rex Kern, following Dave Cheney, that delayed run, the draw, works to perfection. Here's the replay of the Kern Nesty Plunge. He's in for six. Now the extra point to tie it. The snap, the place, the kick. And it is dead center. We have a 14-14 game with 8.29 left in the half. You're witnessing, you're witnessing a slobber knocker here in Tennessee at Neyland Stadium. Scram to kick deep. Deep for the Volunteers. McLean, the short men are Milam, who has run back a kickoff for a touchdown. And McCleary, here's the boot. Fielded around the 10. 21 yard return for McLean. Volunteers have it first and 10 on their 30. 8.15 left in the half. 14 14. Bobby Scott under center. Thelier is the tight end. McLean and Thompson are your wideouts. McLeary and Watson, your split backs. Tatum comes up in run support. We're going to show blitz, but not blitz. 4 3. And play man run coverage. Flag on the play. False start. Offense. Five yard penalty. Repeat. First down. Thompson with the false start will now make it first and 15 from the Tennessee 25. Defensive line to play normal. 4 3 set. Tatum will stay back. We're going to show blitz, but not blitz. Man basic. Hut, hut. Bobby Scott's going to throw. He throws over the middle. Complete the McLean. Howard on the tackle, gain of 21 on the medium slant. Bobby Scott zips one in there. Lester McLean, two receptions, 34 yards. Harry Howard, second tackle for the Buckeyes. Here come the Volunteers, 14-14, 8-0-1 to play in the half. Defensive line in tight. The rest of the defense skews out. Tatum up and run support. Show blitz, but don't blitz. Man run coverage. They're going to go to the left, and not much there at all as Stillwagon blows it up. Struggling for one yard is McLeary. It'll be second and nine. Second and nine for Tennessee on their 47. Split backs for the Vols. Once again, the defensive line. Actually, we're going to play to the out. Stillwagon will blitz the middle. Tatum will stay back. Man, second and nine. Man run coverage. It's going to be a give to the left. And turning the corner, but just barely... For only two yards is McCleary as DeBivik makes his third tackle for the Buckeyes. A big third and seven here with 7.05 left in the first half. 14-14. Winner advances to the final four in our Action PC 1970 College Football Elite Eight playoff. Third and seven. Woody Hayes is going to change it up a bit. Go to a 3-4. Defensive line in tight. Third and seven. White's going to blitz from the outside. Still wagon. Will spy the quarterback. Man pass coverage. Bobby Scott back to pass. Here comes a blitz. He throws. Complete once again. Third catch for McLean. He now has three receptions, 46 yards. That was a gain of 12. And coming onto the field at wideout for the Tennessee Volunteers is Star Trot. Or Trot Star. I think it's Star Trot. We'll find out. It's Star Trot. First and 10. That was a huge conversion for the Volunteers. First and 10 on the Buckeyes 39. Defensive line in tight. The rest of the defense skewing to the out. Tatum up and run support. Show blitz, but don't blitz. Man run coverage. Hut, hut. Scott's going to throw again. Over the middle. Complete! Complete to Trot for 17! As they're 
moving the ball on the arm of Bobby Scott. Jimmy Young now comes in at wideout. So it's Thompson and Young at wideout. Watson and McCleary, your backs. Failure, the tight end. 6.20 to play. Just as the Buckeyes tied it up, the Volunteers marching down to try to take the lead back. Defensive line in tight. Show blitz, but don't blitz. Tatum up and run support. Man run coverage. Scott gives the ball. It's a run to the right. Not much there. McCleary struggles for two yards. He's tackled by Adams. Doug Adams with his first tackle for the Buckeyes. Second and eight. Under six to play in the half. We're knotted at 14. Show blitz once again. We've been playing a lot of man. We should be able to... They should not beat our man coverage. Let's give them a different look, though. Man zone, show tight, and play pass. Bobby Scott, it's a run to the right, and Tennessee finally busts something. Gain of 15 as Watson had running room. Tackled by Adams. Gain of nine, excuse me. Gain of nine. First and 10. On the Ohio State 11, they can pick up a first down on the Buckeye 1. Man coverage. Line in tight. Show blitz, but don't blitz. Tatum laying back. Man run. It's a run to the left flag on the play. Gain of four for Watson. Holding. Offense. Ten yard penalty. A holding call on Kell. The Buckeyes will accept that. It'll be first and 20 on the Buckeye 21. 501 left in the half. Knotted at 14. Winner advances to the final four. And let's see. Debivouac. Get him out, and let's bring Ralph Holloway in. And 89, let's get him out. And bring Glenn Mason in. Our outside linebacker, White, is a bit winded. We got to keep White in the game, though. From the 21, first and 20. Show blitz. We're not going to blitz. Man pass coverage. Bobby Scott. It's a give. It's a run. It's a big run for Tennessee. Gain of 15. Still wagon drags him down. We thought Bobby was going to throw. Coming in at running back is Steve Wold. So it's Wold and McCleary, Thompson and Trot, your wideouts, and Thelier's the tight end. Bobby Scott under center, second and five with under five to play on the Ohio State six. Hassel Nora will come back in. DeBivik will come back in. Second and five. Defensive line will play normal split. Actually, we'll play the defensive line to the end. We're going to play our defense to the out. The rest of our defense. Second and five. Tatum's going to play back. Run coverage. Man run. It's a hand up, up the middle, and that is stuff. By Stillwagon and Company. Stood up at the line. No gain. Bobby Scott, 6 for 9 passing, 101 yards, a touchdown, and a pick. Stillwagon makes his sixth tackle. Chip Kell will get an earful from the sideline as he missed his run block for the Volunteers. So a third and five here. Ohio State would love to keep Tennessee to a field goal attempt. Again, defensive line in tight, third and five. Let's see here. Tight end, Anderson. Anderson is on him. Why is Anderson on him? Passes a seven. Okay. T 
Tatum's a 7-2. Okay, that's the same. Third and five. Defensive line in tight. Show blitz. We're not going to blitz. Still wagging with Spy, the quarterback. Big play coming up here. Third and five. Man pass. Scott, it's a draw, and oh, good tackle by Holloway. Oh, I thought that was going to pop, but the OSU defense gets there as they ran the draw to Steve Wold. Ralph Holloway makes a, his first tackle, and that was a huge tackle. Here's the replay. It looked like Wold was going to get in for the touchdown, and Holloway with a beautiful tackle. We're going to go for the blocked kick, and the field goal's dead center. It is good. Tennessee takes a 17-14 lead as Hunt puts it right through the middle on the 21-yard field goal attempt. 3.30 to play in the half. Tennessee will get the ball first in the third quarter. Hunt puts the ball on the tee. John Brockington back deep. Harris and Janikowski, the short men, for the Buckeyes. Here's the kickoff by Hunt. Fielded around the 10, 20, 25, 26 yard line goes Janikowski on the short kick, 15 yard return, tackled by Jeffries. So here come the Buckeyes. 317 left in the half. They trail by three. They have two timeouts. Brockington and Hayden are your split backs. Read option left. Kern to keep. The quarterback will keep. Kern, Kern, Kern. Not much there. Rotella. As Kern got slowed down, didn't have good blocking in front of him. And Jamie Rotella makes his seventh tackle. 307 clock running. Second and nine. Brockington. Pitch right. Pitch right to Brockington. Can he turn the corner? No, he cannot. He is blown up. And so is that play. Loss of three as Nettles comes flying through to tackle Big John Brockington. They were keying Brockington. A 4-3 basic short zone. Now a third and 12, and Tennessee calls timeout. They want another crack at this with Bobby Scott. Brad 62, how you doing? As he says, be bold, be daring, Al. Not with this offense. Nope. We're only down three. Third and 12. Hayden and Brockington out wide. Kern on the draw. Kern up the middle. Majors brings him down. Gain of six. Will Tennessee use? Yes, they use another timeout. They have one left, 225 left in the half. Tennessee 17, Buckeyes 14. Here comes the punt team. Gary Lago to punt to Majors. Lago needs a high, deep punt. It's a short punt fielded around the 35-40. Six-yard return by Majors. He was tripped up by Anderson. So with 214 left in the half, Volunteers up three. 17 to 14. Bobby Scott under center. Wold and McCleary your backs. Thompson and McLean your wideouts. Thirler, Thirlier is the tight end. 4-3 set here. Defensive line will play to the out. Still wagon will spy Bobby Scott. We're going to skew our defense to the out. Play man pass coverage. What? It's a run towards the middle. It's going to be a good run. Zigging and zagging. Cutting back towards the middle. Picking up 14 yards is Wold. Jim Stillwagon with his seventh tackle. We're not calling timeout. Tennessee uses their last. 150 left in the half. And we're going to skew our defense to the out. Defensive line in tight. White's going to blitz from the outside. Man pass coverage. It's a pitch out to the left. And immediately brought down <clears throat> by Holloway is McCleary. Gain of one. We're not calling timeout. Clock is running. Second and nine. Second and nine. Defensive line 
to the in. We skew our defense to the out. <laughs> still wagon. Actually, no. Uh, yeah, still wagon will blitz the middle. Man pass coverage. Bobby Scott back to pass under duress. He throws. Complete to failure. He breaks a tackle. Picks up 10 yards. <clears throat> a good job by Bobby Scott picking out his secondary receiver. We're not going to call a timeout. Clock is running at 112 left in the half. Again, we're going to play our defensive line to the end. Skew to the out. Show blitz, but we're not going to blitz. Man pass coverage. It's going to be a pitch out. And that is blown up by Stillwagon. Loss of four as he takes McCleary right out of his cleats on that pop. 48 seconds left in the half. Second and 14. Volunteers on the OSU 37 now. Out of field goal range. And that's how Woody Hayes wants to keep it. Defensive line in tight. Skew our rest of the defense to the out. Show blitz, but we're not going to blitz. Man pass coverage. Bobby, they're going to let the clock run out, I think. And the clock is stopped. Why is the clock stopped? Oh, Scott spikes the ball. Which I don't think was really legal back then, but it's it's in the rules that the way the season was set up. So, so he spikes the ball. We'll say he just throws it out of bounds. Thirty eight seconds left. Skew our defensive line to the out. Show blitz. We're not going to blitz. Still water. We'll spy Scott. Man pass coverage. Bobby Scott back to pass. Looking, 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 looking. Throws to the out. And it's complete. And Adams gets out of bounds. You got to make that. Or McCleary gets out of bounds. Doug Adams pushes him out. They pick up nine. 23 seconds left. Still out of field goal range. Fourth and five. Offense stays on the field. Fourth and five. Defensive line in tight. Fourth and five. 4-2 nickel. 4th and 5. Skew to the out. Show blitz. Show tight coverage. Play a deep zone. Or normal coverage. And play pass. Bobby Scott back to pass. Throw a pick 6. Throw a pick 6. Gain of 5. First down. Did he get out? Oh my god. How does he get out of bounds? He gets out of bounds as Scott throws underneath to Watson. He was looking for the short out to Thelier, the tight end, but that was covered. So again, Bobby Scott with the dunk down. Eight seconds left. Man coverage. Four two nickel. Actually, let's go deep zone. Eight seconds left. White will blitz from the outside. Pass. Deep zone. Scott, it's a pick. We got a pick. Here's the pressure. There's the pick. Intercepted by Anderson. No return. And that will end the half. Second pick of Bobby Scott. Oh. So Ohio State defense holds as the half comes to an end. One second left on the clock. Let's watch that replay. Scott throws the pick. Anderson steps in front as they're looking for the short out to Gary Thelier. One second left. We could probably throw a pick six here. Kern will fall down. Walker touches him. 
And that ends the half. So after 30 minutes of football, the Tennessee Volunteers 17, the Ohio State Buckeyes 14. At the stadium, Bears Den 007, hope all is well. As Bears Den said, has Woody Hayes gone out and punched anyone yet? LOL. No, nope, they're not playing Clemson. Though I did mention that early on for anyone who knows about that game. Ohio State. Let's look at how the touchdowns were scored. Brockington had an 8-yard run. Extra point was good. That was at the 7.55 mark of the first quarter. 7-0 Ohio State. Then, on the ensuing kickoff, Milam took it back 94 yards to tie it. Well, the extra point tied it. 7-7. Tennessee took the lead on a Bobby Scott 8-yard pass to Thelier. Extra point good. Vols were up 14-7. Ohio State came back. Finishing their drive, 13-play drive, with a Kern 16-yard draw for the touchdown. Extra point good, 14-14. And then Hunt banged through a 21-yard field goal, 11-play drive, 71 yards, 4 minutes and 41 seconds. And the Vols, at the 3.30 mark in the second quarter, took a 17-14 lead. And that's how we stand to start the third quarter. Bobby Scott, 9 of 14, 125 yards, a touchdown pass, and two picks. Kern is 0 for 2. He's completed one pass to the other team. Kern, 11 carries, 64 yards, and a touchdown. Brockington, 14 for 24. Galbos, 2 for 9. Hayden, 9 for 18. Ohio State's rush for 125 yards. For the Volunteers, Watson, 9 for 32. Wold, 2 for 16. McCleary, 7 for 8. They've rushed for 56 yards. McLean with four receptions and 46 yards. Thelier, six receptions, 48 yards, and a touchdown. Watson and Trot and McCleary also have receptions. For the Volunteers, here's the kickoff and the start of the second half. Fielded short and brought out past the 35. For the Vols, Milam. 18-yard return, a horrible kickoff for the Ohio State Buckeyes. As Brad62 says, the chalkboard has gotten better. I like how it shows the interception. Oh, yeah, it's gotten much better. It's, it's improved every year. What I'd like to see is instead of squares, if they could get a little man, that would be cool. Or let me put helmets in. It'd be cool to actually see helmets. You know, like you could put the Tennessee helmet, like how we put we can either put photos, and since it's a college game, it's tough to find all the photos. So I just put the helmets in. You put you put it for one player, and you say, use this photo for everybody. I like to see the helmets here. It'd be cool if we could put helmets here. Yeah, I mean, you'd have to hover on them to get your information, but I, it'd be a nice little option to try. If you didn't like it, you didn't have to do it. All right, first and 10 for the Vols on their 37. Scott under center, Thelier the tight end, McLean and Thompson, your wideouts, McCleary and Watson, your backs. Defensive line in tight. Tatum up and run support. Man run coverage. It's a give up the middle, and it's a good tough run for three yards on the trap left to McCleary. Brought down by Stillwagon. That was a tough run. Could have got stuck for nothing. So yeah, and like if you'd rather have a jersey out there, you or pads and stuff, you, they could put a little guy. It doesn't have to run, but just the little guy image, and then it would just move, sort of like electric football in a way. That would be kind of cool. It doesn't have to be like pro strategy football, where the the guys you see the animation, which is really cool. That's not their thing, but you know, just a little something different instead of squares. It'd just be a nice change. I, I think it'd be cool. And you could have squares too. It'd be up to, it would be up to the person. Again, I don't know how much that entails, but I think if you can put squares in, you could put a little thing that looks like a player in. I think it'd be fun to look at. All right, second and seven for the Vols. Bobby Scott barks out the signals. Defensive line will play normal. We're going to show blitz, but we're not going to blitz. 
Oh, I was playing zone. That's why that guy got freaking three yards. Man, pass coverage on second and seven. It's going to be a run to the right, and that is blown up as Adams comes up and takes Watson right off his feet. Loss of three. Doug Adams with his fourth tackle. The Buckeyes are pumped third and ten. Kurt Watson, 10 carries, 29 brutally painful black and blue yards. They have to get Tennessee off the field now, the Buckeyes. They trail by three, 14-20 left in the third quarter. Defensive line out wide. Show blitz, but don't blitz. Man, pass coverage. Uh, still wagon. Will spy the quarterback. Bobby Scott could run, I thought. You know what? I'm wrong. Let's not spy the quarterback. That's a waste. I thought Bobby Scott was a running type of quarterback in the NFL. Maybe he just played on those poop teams and it made him look like a running quarterback. Um, or am I thinking of Bobby Douglas? Maybe I'm thinking of Bobby Douglas. Third and ten. We shouldn't have to play a zone. Our guys, they should not catch the ball on our guys. Third and ten. I'm not doubling anybody. Man pass coverage. Scott back to pass. Flag on the play. Throws to the out. Complete. You've got to be kidding me. 18 yards. Senzimba pushes. Encroachment. Defense. Five yard penalty. Well, they're gonna decline. They're gonna decline that. And take the 18. How do you get burned on that? Senzimba. Oh, he got his jock handed to him. Ouch. Big first down conversion for the Volunteers. First and 10 on the OSU 45. Defensive line in tight. Tatum up and run support. Man run coverage. Handoff up the middle, and he is stuffed, and Stillwagon tries to rip the ball out of Watson's hands. And they're going to give him a favorable spot. They're going to say he gained a yard. Jim Stillwagon with 10 tackles, second and nine on the OSU 44. Defensive line out wide, still wagon's going to blitz the middle. Second and nine, man run. Bobby Scott's going to throw over the middle to failure. It's caught, first down. Gain of 12, Anderson brings down the tight end for the Vols. First and 10 on the OSU 32. First and 10, Bobby Scott. Uh, 15 more passes. He's still good aim. Man pass coverage. Scott, it's a draw. It's a good one. Five yards for Watson. As Norrell makes his second tackle for the Buckeyes, it'll be second and five. White will blitz. Man pass coverage. It's a run to the right, and it is smothered under as McLeary struggles for a one-yard gain. It'll be third and four tackle by Doug Adams. That's his fifth. So third and four. They're not in field goal range, so you know they're going to... It's a two-down territory here for the Volunteers. They have a 17-14 lead with 12-28 left in the third quarter. Third and four. Defensive line out wide. Third and four. Still wagon's going to blitz the middle. Man pass coverage. Bobby Scott back to pass under duress. He scrambles and he is nailed. He gets one yard. Adams with his sixth tackle. Fourth and three, the Vols keep their offense on the field. As the ball is on the OSU 25, and they are not in field goal range. My, how kicking has changed. Fourth and three. Defensive line in tight. Fourth and three, man pass coverage. Scott's going to throw, and it's picked off! The third time OSU has picked off Bobby Scott. And it's Doug Adams. Doug Adams has been huge defensively on this drive. 
So the OSU defense holds once again. Bobby Scott, 11 for 17, 155 yards, a touchdown, and three picks. Here's the replay of the Adams interception. Stepping right in front. Looked like he was trying to dump it down to the safety valve. The initial person looked like Don McCleary on the hitch. So here come the Buckeyes trailing by three with 11.35 to play in the third quarter. Brockington and Hayden are your backs. Zelina and Janikowski are your wideouts. White is the tight end. Screen to John Brockington. They don't like the play. Uh, Kern's going to audible. Dive to Hayden. Hayden up the middle. A good tough run. Five yards brought down by Mixon. So a good audible by Kern, who has not completed a pass yet. Second and five. Hayden on the dive again. And not much room this time. Struggles for one. Pulled down by Allen of the Volunteers. David Allen with three tackles now. They were keying John Brockman, but the defense moved quite quickly when Hayden got the ball. So a big third and four here for the Buckeyes on their 39. Hayden will go out. Rick Galbos comes in. Third and four. Read option left. Read option left. Kern to keep. Stick with the play call. Kern to keep. Kern to keep. Kern's got the first down of Moore. He's past midfield. Almost to the 40. Finally brought down from behind by Rotella. A 20-yard run by Rex Kern. 12 carries, 84 yards, and a touchdown for Kern. And that was huge. They moved the change. Change. Excuse me. Buckeyes have it first and 10 on the Volunteers 41. Here's the Kern run for 20. The replay as he keeps the read option. And Rotella with a touchdown saving tackle. So first and 10. Now maybe we got a Kern... Okay, Brockner and Galbos are still in. Read option right. Going to give it to Galbos this time. Read option right. Galbos has it. And that play gets blown up by Priest. As he reads the rights. Last rights over Galbos there. What a pop he put on him. Tim Priest makes his first tackle, and what a hit. So second and ten, second and ten. Galbos, run counter, trap left. Galbos, nothing there. Rotella comes up and brings down Galbos. Third and ten. Jamie Rotella, nine tackles, one away from ten. Galbos goes out. John Hayden comes in. Third and ten. Rex Kern up the middle. Kern breaks a tackle, and he's going to pick up eight. Second tackle made by Tim Priest. He saved the first down for the moment. Fourth and two. Offense stays on the field for Woody Hayes. Ball on the Tennessee 33, under 10 to play in the third quarter. Fourth and two. They go to the I formation. The up back is Hayden. Actually, you know what? Who's a good short yardage back? Hayden is a five. What's Brockton? He's got to be a good short yardage back. Yeah, Brockman's a seven. I knew he was a seven. Fourth and two. They're going to probably key Brockington. Trap. 
Trap left. John Brockman, fourth and two. Flag on the play. Let it be on the defense. False start. Oh, my Offense. God. Five-yard penalty. Oh, Woody Hayes is going insane on the sideline. False start on Cheney. It's now fourth and seven from the Tennessee Volunteers, 38. Fourth and seven. Fourth and seven. Strong right. Read option right. Kern to keep, fourth and seven. Stick with the play call. And Kern will not get there. He picks up five, two yards short. And Tennessee holds. They'll have it first and ten on their 33 with 9.04 left in the third quarter. That five-yard penalty by Cheney is a killer, and he doesn't want to go back to the sideline, but he has to and face the wrath of Woody Hayes. First and 10. We're going to play our defensive line normal. Show blitz. We're not going to blitz. Man, run coverage. It's a run up the middle. Flag on the play. Tennessee, that's a good run. Fumble, who's got it? Who comes away from the scrum? The ball is loose. Encroachment. And defense. Five-yard penalty. Well, it wouldn't have mattered anyway. But they pick up 11. The fumble is recovered by Tennessee. They will decline it. Had Ohio State gotten the ball, they would have accepted the encroachment on Dubivik. So Ohio State almost gets another turnover. First and 10 on the Tennessee 44. 8.51 left in the third quarter. Tatum comes up and runs support. Defensive line in tight. Man run coverage. It's a handoff up the middle and nowhere to go. Still wagon stood up Watson and then brought him hard to the ground. Second and ten. Don Denebo missed his block. Jim Stillwagon, 12 tackles for the middle linebacker of the Buckeyes. Ball on the Tennessee 44. Watson and McCleary, your backs. Thompson and McLean, your wideouts. Thelier is the tight end. Bobby Scott, who's thrown three picks, is under center. Second and 10. Show blitz. We're not going to blitz. Man pass coverage. It's a run to the right. It'll be a minimal gain. Actually, five yards. So McCleary keeps his legs churning, drags Adams for a couple more yards before Doug Adams gets some help. But he'll be credited with his seventh tackle. A big third and five here for the Tennessee Volunteers and the Ohio State Buckeyes. 8-14 left in the third quarter. Tennessee 17, Ohio State 14. Third and five. Defensive line in tight. Still wagon will blitz the middle. Man pass coverage. It's a run, and they're not going to get it. Only a pickup of two by Watson as White nailed him. Watson spun away from him, but Adams was there to bring him down. Fourth and three, and here comes a volunteer punt team. The return is on for Ohio State. Tennessee trying to pin him back deep. That ball's going to go out of bounds. At the 18, 31-yard punt by Majors. 7-14 to play in the third quarter. Ohio State trails by three. Brockington and Hayden are your backs. Zelina and Janikowski, your wideouts. White's the tight end. Short slant to Larry Zelina. Kern throws. Complete! Holy cow, Kern's completed a pass. Gain of six. As they're keying John Brockington on that play. Second and four. Second and four. Read option. Read option right. Kern to keep. Hut, hut. 
Kern on the read option. And flag on the play. He's got the first down. Personal foul. Defense. Yes. 15 yard penalty. Automatic. That's going to be tacked on. That's going to be Johnny Majors with a late hit. As Kern goes over the century mark now. 104 yards for Rex Kern on 15 carries. And he has a touchdown. And they're going to add 15 to that gain of 7. The Buckeyes have it first and 10 on their 46. 634 left in the third quarter. Short slant, actually short out to Bruce. Play action fake, short out to Bruce Janikowski. Kern doesn't like what he sees. Dive play to Brockton and out of the split backfield. Brockton and busts it up the middle. He's close to the first. He picks up nine. Brought down by Nettles, second and one on the Tennessee 45 as OSU crashes into volunteer territory. Good read by Kern to change the play. Excellent block by Brian Donovan of the Buckeyes. He might have earned a Buckeye for that block. On the old helmet there. Second and one. Kern. On the dive. Kern up the middle. And he is nailed by Drummond's a loser yard as Kern is taken off his feet like a cartoon character and planted like a turnip. Third and two. Holy cow, was that a pop. Ronnie Drummond with his fourth tackle, and this time Brian Donovan misses his block. Third and two. I formation. Actually, we're going to go two tight end set. Two tight end set. The lone wide out is Zelina. And I formation. John Brockington. Run counter. Off tackle left. Brockington is stood up, only picks one yard. Rotella makes his 10th tackle, brings up a fourth and one on the Tennessee 45. 523 left in the third quarter. The Buckeyes offense stays on the field. Woody Hayes says, if we can't make a yard, I will shoot you. Two tight ends set. The up back, Hayden, on the run counter, trap right, fourth and one, Hayden, he's close, and they bring out the sticks, he's got it, first down. So the Buckeyes have another crack at it, first and 10 on the Tennessee 44, 4.54 left in the third quarter, volunteers clinging to that three point lead, 17 to 14. There's been no scoring in the third quarter. Hayden goes out wide in this two tight end set. Brockington, sweep right. Come on, Johnny. Brockington does not turn the corner, actually tries to cut back to the middle. No gain as Walker makes the tackle on big John Brockington. Jackie Walker with three tackles for Tennessee now. Second and ten. Second and ten. Two tight end set. Read option. Left. Kern to keep. Uh, Kern audibles. Dive to Hayden. Hayden up the middle. Flag on the play. 12 men on the field. Offense, oh five-yard penalty. Oh, my Lord. Five yards. 12 men on the field. Woody Hayes is, again, going insane on the sideline. Second and 15. This is where the Buckeyes do not want to be. Second and 15. And we're going to go with a three-wide-out set now. And the lone back will be John Brockington. Brockton will go out wide. Kern on the draw. Kern doesn't like what he sees. He's going to heave it up. Medium fly to Zelina. Kern's going to throw. Complete! Oh, he dropped it. 
Pass interference. Yes. Defense. Yes. Automatic. Yes, yes. First down. So Kern throws it up to Zelina, who was interfered with by Majors. First down. That is huge. So the Buckeyes convert. First and 10 on the Tennessee 35. They will stick with the three wide out set. Give the ball to Brockington on a off tackle left. Kern doesn't like what he sees. Dive play to Brockington. Brockington up the middle. He struggles for two. Brought down by Mixon of the Volunteers. Manly Mixon with his fourth tackle. The Volunteers were in a 4-2 nickel playing the run. I thought you couldn't play the run in a 4-2 nickel. Brockton will come out. And John Hayden will come in. Three wide out set again. Second and eight. Second and eight. Let's bring the tight end strong right. Strong left. Excuse me. And now let's go read option right. Kern to keep. Read option right. Kern to keep. Can he turn the corner? Kern the corner. And he picks up five. Kern with 108 yards on 17 rushes. Tackled by Ronnie Drummonds. That's his fifth tackle. Third and three. Third and three for OSU. Two down territory here. Three minutes left in the third quarter. 17-14 Volunteers. Third and three. Hayden, up the middle. Flag on the play. Picks up one. Holding. Offense. 10-yard oh penalty. They're going to decline it. It makes it fourth and two. Wow, they decline it. They think they can hold them on fourth and two. I would have took the penalty. Fourth and two. Ohio State goes back to the split backfield and two wideouts. So Brockington and Hayden, your backs. Zelina and Janikowski, your wideouts. White's the tight end. Kern's under center. Fourth and two. So let's go full house here. Fourth and two, full house. Um, Galbos is in the penalty, so let's not give him the damn ball. Let's get Galbos out of the game. Uh, Colburn, come in. I don't think, can we put Colburn out wide? Yes, we can. Colburn out wide. Fourth and two. Hayden's here. Read option right. Fourth and two. Brockton with the carry. They're going to give it to Brockton. Read option right. And no! He cannot turn the corner. He only picks up one. Nettles brings him down. The Buckeyes cannot convert. Turnover on downs. The Volunteers take over first and 10 on their 26 with 240 to play in the third quarter. Bobby Scott will now try to direct Tennessee's offense to try to get some more points on the board. Watson and McLeary are your backs. Thompson and McLean, your wideouts. Failure, the tight end. First and 10. Man pass. It's going to be a pitch out to the left. And it's going to be a good run. First down, gain of 11. Still wagon with the tackle. Robinson was injured and going off the field. I believe that is for the Volunteers. Watson now at 16 carries, 59 yards. First and 10 at Tennessee, 37, 213 left in the third quarter. Defensive line in tight. Man run. 
It's a give up the middle. Nothing there. Holloway and company wrap up. Watson on the quick hitter. No gain. One yard gain. Favorable spot. Robinson is now available once again for Tennessee. So second and nine. Two eleven left in the third quarter. Tennessee up by three. Defensive line in tight. Second and nine. What did I say? Third and nine. Second and nine. Show blitz. Show loose coverage. Man pass coverage. It's going to be a run to the left. Decent gain for Watson. He picks up six. Still lagging. Makes his 14th tackle. Tennessee is three for 10 on third down conversions. Watson 18 for 66 now. Big third and three here as the third quarter comes to an end as there's 134 left to play. Third and three, defensive line in tight. Third and three. Show blitz, but don't blitz. Man run coverage. Bobby Scott's going to throw. And it's batted down by Williams. So the Ohio State defense holds again. Nearly Bobby Scott almost had his fourth pick. But Williams couldn't hold on to the ball. When you don't get there, get your hands up, they say. The return is on. Here's the punt by the Volunteers. And it goes out at the 13. 43-yard punt. 51 seconds left in the third quarter. Here comes OSU once again. Down by three. Directing the offense is Rex Kern. Brockington and Hayden are your backs. Zelina and Janikowski, your wideouts. White is the tight end. Screen to Brockington on first down. Complete. Brockington has a little bit of room. He picks up three. Nettles brings him down. He torpedoed the big man's legs. Ray Nettles with his eighth tackle. 36 seconds left in the quarter. Second and seven. Second and seven. Hayden. Off tackle right. There goes Hayden. First down. Seven yards as he bowls over Priest. But Priest holds on. Three seconds left in the quarter, and that will end it. So 15 more minutes of football. Ohio State trailing by three. We'll have the ball first and 10 on their 23. Tennessee 17, Ohio State 14. The winner advances to the final four. Brockington to get the call. Off tackle right. Brockington. <laughs> Nothing there. Nothing there. Struggles for a yard. Wrapped up by Ray Nettles and company. Nettles be credited with his ninth tackle. They were keying Brockington. So it's going to be second and nine. Play action fake. Short slant to Larry Zelina. Kern to Zelina, and he dropped the ball as Graham put the pop on him. Third and nine. He would have been short of the first down, but it would have been much more manageable than a third and nine. Third and nine. Read option. Read option left. Kern to keep. Read option left. Rex Kern is picking up seven. And it'll be fourth and two. And here comes the punt team. Gary Lago will punt deep to Bobby Majors. Here's the punt by Lago. Majors fields it around the 33. And he gets to the 45. 37 yard punt, 13 yard return by Majors. He was tackled by Anderson. Tennessee starts in sweet field position, first and 10 on their 45. Watson and McLeary are your backs. Thompson and McLean, your wideouts. Thelier's the tight end. Bobby Scott is under center. Volunteers up by three. Tatum up in run support. Defensive line in tight. Man run coverage. It's a run to the left. 
And Howard brings down the ball carrier, McCleary, only a gain of one yard. Ohio State's defense has to hold once again. Second and nine for the Volunteers. Bobby Scott surveys the situation. 4-3 set for the Buckeyes. Stillwagon will blitz the middle. Defensive line to the out. Man pass coverage. Here's the blitz. Scott's going to throw incomplete as Tatum tries to jump that route for the pick. He deflected it. At running back now for Tennessee is George Silve. He sees his first action. 5.8 yards a carry on 41 carries. Third and nine. This is a big play here. Tennessee 3 for 11 on third down conversions. Third and nine from the Tennessee 46. White will blitz from the outside. Man pass coverage. Scott throws. Incomplete. Try to go over the middle. He's checked down to Watson, but good coverage by the Buckeyes. And Woody Hayes is very happy with his defense. Now the offense has to get going. Fourth and nine. Here's the punt. The return is on. Fielded at the 20. Brought out to the 26 by Anderson. Seven-yard return. On the 34-yard punt, he took a big hit. Edwards pancaked him. So actually, it's out to the 27. Buckeyes get it first and 10. 12.56 left in the game. I formation. The up back is Hayden. Brockington behind him. John Brockington to get the call. Trap right, John Brockington. <laughs> Nothing there. Struggles for a yard. Nettles makes the tackle. Ray Nettles now has 10 tackles. Tennessee's defense has been quite stingy. Second and nine. I formation again. Zelina and Janikowski, your wideouts. White's the tight end. Brockington to get the call again. Trap left this time. Brockington. Nothing there. Mixon and company bring him down. As he Brockington struggles for a yard. Brian Donovan misses his block. Woody Hayes again going insane on the sideline. Mixing with five tackles. Brings up a third and eight with 12-16 left in the game. Hayden. Out wide. Kern. Read option left. Read option left, Kern to keep. Kern, read option left, he keeps. And he is brought down behind the line of scrimmage. Loss of one. Fourth and nine, under 12 to play. Here comes a punt team. Lago to punt to Majors. Majors fields it around the 35, brings it out past the 40. It's an eight yard return brought down by Batista of OSU. So 11.36 left in the game. Volunteers up 17-14. First and 10 on their 42. Bobby Scott under center. Watson and McLeary, your backs. Thompson and McLean, your wideouts. Failure is the tight end. Defensive line in tight. Man, run coverage. It's a run to the left. And quickly accelerating through a small gap is Watson. Gain is 17. Tackled by Stillwell. Stillwagon. Jim Stillwagon now has 15 tackles for OSU. Brings up second and three. Again, the defensive line in tight. Man run coverage. Run to the left. First down. Gain of six. Tatum missed the tackle. White brought him down. Stan White with two tackles now. First and ten as Tennessee goes to ground and pound on the OSU 45. 10.48 left in the game. Volunteers clinging to a three-point lead. Defensive line in tight. Tatum up in run support. Man run coverage. Bobby Scott, handoff to the left. And this time Stillwagon says none shall pass. Aided by the gazillion men up in the box. Second and 10. Jim Stillwagon with 16 tackles. Stillwagon has been a beast for the OSU defense. 
Second and ten. Scott surveys the situation. OSU will show... Bl Actually, we're going to blitz. We're going to blitz. Still Wagon will blitz the middle. Defensive line will be at a normal split. Man pass coverage. Bobby Scott, it's a handoff up the middle. Williams drags down the runner. Sylvie from behind, six yards though. And a big third and four with under 10 minutes to play in the game. The Buc Buckeyes 14, the Volunteers 17. Tennessee is three for 12 on third down conversions. Third and four, defensive line in tight. White will blitz from the outside. Third and four, man pass. What? Scott looking to throw under duress. And it is picked off by Anderson. Go, Anderson. Go, go, go. Brings it past midfield. It's a 24-yard return by Anderson. Tim Anderson's second interception. And my God, the Ohio D State defense has played stout. They've only given up 10 points. The other touchdown was after they scored. OSU scored on the ensuing kickoff. Tennessee ran it back 94 yards for a TD. Anderson with his second touchdown. Here's the replay. Bobby Scott now 11 of 21, 155 yards, one touchdown, and I believe four picks. Four picks. And again, after the Brockington eight-yard touchdown run, Millman returned the kick off for 94 yards. So the OSU defense has only given up 10 points. We've got to punch it in now. 9.23 left in the game. Hayden, trap left. Not much there. Picks up two yards. Tennessee's defense has been stout. He was brought down by Bill Emmendorfer. That's his third tackle. They were keying Brockington on the play. Second and eight. Second and eight. Kern on the delayed run. Draw Kern. Kern goes up the middle. Dives forward for three. All eyes were on Brockington. Johnny Wagster makes his seventh tackle for the Volunteers. Under nine minutes of play in the game. Third and five from the Tennessee 35. Three wide out set. The lone back is John Brockington. Kern under center. Your wide outs are Zelina Jan uh, Janikowski and Campana. White's the tight end. Kern on the draw once again. Kern! And nothing there! In fact, he loses two. Oh, my Lord. Fourth and seven. Fourth and seven. Kern. On the bootleg. Fourth and seven. And he is knocked sideways by Rotella as he barely gets back to the line of scrimmage and the Tennessee defense holds. Seven forty-three left in the game. Scott under center, probably with orders not to throw the ball anymore. Watson and McCleary, your running backs. Thompson, McLean, your wideouts. Failure is the tight end. Tatum comes up in run support. Defensive line in tight. Man run coverage. It's a handoff and no place for the runner to go as Watson is knocked for a one-yard loss. Adams will get his ninth tackle. Second and 11. Second and 11. They will show blitz. Man basic. Scott's going to throw. Complete. Oh, my Lord. Come on, Sinzenbaum. Gain of 18. Joe Thompson, two receptions, 36 yards. And Bobby Scott finally completes a pass to someone besides OSU in this quarter. 7.01 left in the game. First and 10 on the Buckeye 46. Defensive line in tight. Tatum up. Run support. 
man run coverage. It's a run to the right. Sizenbaugh blows that play up. No gain. Watson gets up slowly. Sizenbaugh with three tackles. Kurt Watson, 22 carries, 78 yards. 629 left in the game. Second and 10. Show blitz. We're not going to blitz. Man pass. Scott back to pass. Throws. Dumps it down to his safety valve. The running back. McCleary picks up five. The tackle is the tenth for Doug Adams for the Buckeyes. A big third and five now. Clock going tick, tick, tick on the Buckeyes. 5.55 to play in the game. Volunteers clinging that three-point lead. Third and five. Defensive line out wide. Stillwagon will blitz the middle. Third and five. Man pass. Bobby Scott. It's a draw. God damn it. Oh, he stuffed it. Yes. Adams nails Watson. Only a gain of two. Fourth and three. And Tennessee will try to pin Ohio State in the shadow of their own end zone. As here comes the punt team. The return is on. Do not hit the kicker. Here's the punt. It's going to go out inside the 15. Actually, the zebra walks up a few steps, and they're saying it went out at the 15. So with 5.02 to play, Ohio State has to find some offense here. They're down by three. First and 10 on their 15. Brockton and Hayden, your split backs. Rex Kern under center. Zelina and Janikowski, your wideouts. White is the tight end. Brockton and Hayden. I don't think they would throw there, though. Well, let's see. Let's see if we leave three blockers in. Zelina. That's a disaster waiting to happen. Four against a six. Three against a six. Zelina. Play action fake. Medium fly, three extra blockers. Kern's going to throw it up. Flag on the play. Complete the Zelina. Don't let it be on us, please. Encroachment defense. Decline. Five-yard penalty. We will decline. All right. First and 10 on the OSU 28. 13. That's a medium fly, 13 yards. Well, we completed it. We can't complain. Connor Graham makes his sixth tackle for Tennessee. Brockington. Actually, ooh, bad. Don't do that. Read option left. Brockton will get the carry. Come on, Johnny. Come on, Johnny. Come on. Oh, my God. Only picks up one yard as Rotella knocks him out of bounds. Clock stops with 4.37 to play. Second and nine from the OSU 29. Short hitch to Bruce Janikowski. Flag on the play. Jumped off Ball side. start. <sighs> Offense. Five-yard penalty. Repeat. Second Zelina down. Zelina moves. And now it's four, second and 14. Second and 14. With 4.37 left in the game. Read option right. Kern to keep. Kern to keep. Kern, turn that corner, baby. Turn. Oh, minimal gain. Two yards shoved out of bounds by Nettles. Nettles is a tackling machine today. He's got 12 for Tennessee and a crucial third and 12 here. Third and 12, 423 left in the game. Both teams with all three timeouts. Play action fake. They're going to look for Jan White, the tight end. Short cross over the middle. Kern throws and dropped. After bobbling the ball is White. Probably would have made the first down anyway. It's fourth and 12. 417 left in the game. Here comes the punt team, Gary Lago, to punt to Majors. We need a fumble here. We need something. Majors brings it out to the 46, I think. Nine-yard return on a 42-yard punt. DeLeon with the tackle. 
Tennessee has it first and 10 on their 41. 406 left in the game. Tennessee looking to grind it out. Tatum comes up and runs support. Defensive line in tight. Man run coverage out of the 4-3. It's a run to the right. Williams is t makes the tackle on McCleary. No gain. 3.53 left. And we're going to call timeout now. We have two left. Two timeouts left. <laughs> Second and nine, defensive line in tight. Man run coverage. Run up the middle, and Stillwagon makes the tackle. Loss of one. Watson was nearly taken out of his cleats. Jim Stillwagon, 17 tackles. And we'll call our second timeout. OSU with one timeout left. Third and ten. Show blitz, we're not going to blitz. Man pass coverage. Scott back to pass. He throws. Incomplete. No flag. No flag. We force the punt. We're going for the punt block. Oh! We hit the kicker. No, they pick up the flag. Oh, my Lord, we lucked out. They pick up the yellow hanky. Ohio State gets a reprieve from the governor. 3.23 left in the game. Ohio State down by three. They have the ball on there, 22. And a long way to go and a short time to get there as they sit in Smokey and the Bandit. We need a big run here. Reverse to Janikowski. Janikowski! Pass midfield! Go, 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 go! Yeah! 46 yards on the reverse to Janikowski! That's what Ohio State needed, baby! 2.50 left in the game. Here's the replay. Woody Hayes thinking outside the box. A reverse to Janikowski. He almost goes all the way. Touchdown saving tackle by Bobby Majors. Woo! 250 left in the game. First and 10 on the Tennessee 32. As the Volunteers are in a 4 3 playing the pass. Come on, Big John. We need you now. Brockington, run counter, off tackle left, Brockington, and he's going to plow forward for three. We go to the hurry up. Hayden, run counter, trap right. Nothing there for Hayden. Picks up one. It's going to be third and six. Third and six. They're in the hurry up. He's in the penalty. Okay, don't do that. That would be bad. Oh, when we're in the hurry up, we can't run the read option. That sucks. Kern. Head out of bounds. Sweep right, Rex Kern. Picks up one, knocked out of bounds. Fourth and five, and we're on the Tennessee 27, and we're not even in field goal range. 134 left, we're not even in field goal range. Oh, my God. Fourth and five. Fourth 
fourth and five. Short cross of Bruce Janikowski. Fourth and five. This is the game. Kern scrambles first down. He's going for the touchdown. Oh, Kern scrambles. He is brought down after a 26-yard scramble. Holy cow. Rex Kern. Oh, my Lord. Unbelievable. Here's the replay. Rex Kern. Takes off running the pocket, collapsing, no one open. He almost breaks it for the touchdown. Touchdown saving tackle by Tim Priest. Clock is running. Clock is running. They go to the hurry up. I formation. Ball on the Tennessee one. They're going to give it to Brockington on the dive. And he is stuffed. No gain. 31 seconds. They stick with the hurry up. Kern. That's a bad play. Brockington. Run counter. Trap left. <laughs> Touchdown, John Brockington! OSU takes the lead with 25 seconds. Unbelievable! Unbelievable! 12, actually 12 seconds left in the game. It is 20 to 17. What a game! Here's the extra point to put them up by four. It is good! The Buckeyes in improbable fashion are 12 seconds away from victory and advancing to the final four. 12 seconds. Squib kick. Tackle him. One second left. One second left. One second left. Four to nickel. Deep zone. Prevent. Bobby Scott's got to heave it up. I will throw. And Bobby Scott is sacked. This ball game is over. This ball game is over. Ohio State comes back to win. O-S-U, O-S-U, O-S-U. Tennessee is stunned. Ohio State comes back on two big running plays, one on the reverse by Janikowski, then fourth and five. Rex Kern says, you know I can't throw the damn ball. Scrambles for 26. He's tackled at the one. And then John Brockington on the second try with the clock running down. Woody Hayes having confidence in his team. No timeout, baby. Just punch it in. And that's what they did, a la Vince Lombardi and the Packers in the ice bowl. What a game. Whew. We'll bring up the box score or the stat report in a moment. If you watched the whole thing or joined us at the end, you saw one heck of a game, folks. As TribesFan879 says, wow, wow, wow. Bears Den, nice go Big Ten. Stats are close to. Wow. 
Unbelievable. Game-winning touchdown is scored by John Brockington with 12 seconds left in the game. Kern with a huge scramble for 26. And to start us off, we went to that reverse to Janikowski. Yes, it feels so good to beat the computer. Woo! All right, let's go to team stats. Net offense, Ohio State 312, Tennessee 9 uh, 292. You got to remember, Tennessee only scored 10 points on offense. They had the kickoff return for a touchdown. The only points scored in the second half, seven by Ohio State. At the end, John Brockington takes the plunge that sends OSU to the final four, baby. Turnovers. Tennessee turned it over four times. They relied way too much on Bobby Scott's arm. Ohio State had two turnovers, a fumble and a pick, I believe. Wow. All right, let's quickly go to some player stats. Ohio State's de uh, defense is the MVP along with Kern. Player stats. Kern, 3 of 7, 22 yards and an interception. Bobby Scott, 13 of 24, 178 yards, a touchdown and four picks. Kern, 25 rushes, 144 yards and a touchdown. Janikowski, 1 for 46. That was huge, that reverse we called. That was freaking huge, that reverse. Uh, Brockton had 26 carries, 45 yards. Two touchdowns, though. Hot Hayden, 16 for 36. Galbos, 4 for 19. For Tennessee, Watson, 24 for 79. McCleary, 13 for 19. Wold, 2 for 16. Sil Sylvie, or they... One for six. Scott, two for minus six. Those were... Zelina, one, uh, two receptions, 19 yards. Brockton, one for three. And the defense was stout. Stout. Thelier, four for 60 and a touchdown. McLean, three for 46 for the Volunteers. McCleary, two for 14. Thompson, two receptions, 36 yards. Trot, one for 17. And Watson, one for five. The defense was stout. Still wagging 17 tackles, three stuffs, and a forced fumble. Adams, 11 tackles, two stuffs. Anderson had six tackles, two deflections. The picks, uh, where are the interceptions here? Still wagging with one. Uh, no, I'm sorry. Adams with one. Anderson with two. And Sizenbaum with one. He got burned quite a bit, though. We only had one sack. It came at the end of the game by Hasenorl. Leading tackler for Tennessee, Jamie Rotella with 13, followed by Nettles with 12. The pick was by Rotella. Forced fumble by Rotella. Rotella played his cleats off. It was an unbelievable game. As Brad62 says, Brockton had to earn that yard. And he says those picks were costly. We called a good defensive game. I'm happy with myself. I'm happy with myself. I hate getting annihilated by the computer. So Ohio State... Goes to the Final Four. Other three games up on the channel. I'm not going to spoil them. Some were good and some weren't. But <laughs> Final Four is set. Check it out. Stay with us. Been a fun little tournament. These streams go long. I talk to the chat. I talk about my strategy. If you don't like long streams, don't want, you know, I'm not the person to watch. I, I talk my strategies out. I enjoy the chat. Hopefully the live chat will play this time as I'm having issues on the replay with the live chat. But that's it, folks, and let's quickly go to the scoring. Ohio State scored first at the 7.55 mark of the first quarter. Brockton, an 8-yard run, extra point good after an 8-play, 35-yard drive. 7 nothing. Buckeyes. And then on the kickoff, Millman returned at 94 yards, 7-7. Seven, seven. Extra point good. Tennessee takes the lead on a Bobby Scott to Thelier touchdown pass. 14-7 kick was good. Ohio State would then tie it up when Kern, on a draw on third and long, ran it in for 16. 14-14. Hunt would put Tennessee up by three with 3.30 to go in the half. He hit a 21-yard field goal, and it stayed 17-14 until 12 seconds left in the game. John Brockington, on his second try from the one, plunged it in. Big plays on that drive. The Janikowski reverse for 46. And fourth and five 
A 26-yard scramble, I think it was, by Kern that brought it to the one. Ohio State advances, baby. O-S-U. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Stay with the channel. Check out all the wonderful content creators in our community, such as Tribe Street 879, SDG Replays, and many, many more. Thank you very much for your time. I greatly appreciate it. Health and happiness. Be safe. Be smart. God bless. You know what's coming, baby. Peace! OSU with a comeback victory in one of the best games